day 1174 it's 8:06 a.m just got off uh my warriors of god call and then did an individual call with one of the warriors um such a good both of them were great calls the first call was talking about the fear of the lord and what would our lives look like if he took his hand off our lives um and the second call was a one-on-one -on -one, uh where um i was just being encouraged to to with the pornography and the masturbation um <clears throat> and we were talking about uh like getting through that and um they were saying like it's gonna be it's gonna be tough you know it's gonna be hard but it's possible you know to stop it and it was crazy because every time they said that there was like this thing inside me that was like er, wrong and i was like what and it's like every time they said it's gonna be tough it's gonna be hard it was like wrong deception deception and um i finally jumped in and i was like okay i just have to express this because everything that was said 99 percent of what you said was great and amazing and encouraging but that one percent that one percent poison that the enemy likes to bring into a conversation that's the deception because it's going to be tough and it's going to be hard if i try to do it in my own power but if i do it with the lord it's effortless like the pornography i renounce that I made a vow to the Lord and it's as if it disappeared. It's not even an option. It's not like the door behind me was closed and sealed shut. It's like the door behind me was closed, sealed shut and disintegrated where there's not even a door there. It's not even an option. <clears throat> and, and it's the same thing with the masturbation now. It's not even an option. I made a vow to the Lord. It's it's not even an option. So it's effortless. It's It's deliverance. And I was explaining to them like that difference between deliverance god delivering us and us trying to deliver ourselves us trying to do it in our own strength versus us doing it in god's strength in god's strength it's effortless that's why he says my yoke is light like come to me all who are, are burdened and weary and and um and my and take on my yoke and my yoke is easy and my yoke is light it's like it's not hard it's effortless and it's just like wow just and then he brought the the God brought the story of Gideon to, to my mind where Gideon was in a wine press. Uh, they were being oppressed by the Midians or the Midianites. And um, God called out Gideon out of the wine press to go uh, lead the army and, and defeat their enemies. And he had like 32,000 people and God narrowed it down to 300, 300 warriors, 300 soldiers um and he narrowed it down to that and they defeated i think it was an army of like 130,000 midianites and and god did that to show that it was god that did it not man because if he took the 30,000 soldiers and defeated the 130 then they could say like oh yeah we fought really hard we're just really skilled we're just really strong and powerful and god wouldn't get the glory so god winnowed it down to 300 and 300 defeated 130,000 um so that God would get the glory. So they would know that in God's power and his strength, that that's where the victory is. <clears throat> and so it was just like, God just brought that to my mind um, of like, in God's strength, it's effortless. In our strength, it's effort. It's hard. It's challenging. But in God's strength, it's effortless. And it was just this like, wow, this huge aha moment. So it was such a powerful call. We both learned so much my voice <coughs> i've already done two hours of talking it's only eight uh, i gotta teach a new believers class tonight <clears throat> gotta do some other things my voice i gotta figure that out in the mornings it's just like shot um nope it's not i'm not speaking that over my voice um, <laughs> nope it's great uh and so uh yeah just crazy i'm so grateful that god has not not taken has not stepped away from me he's not turned away from me he's not removed his hand from me i still got the gifts i still got the wisdom i still got the discernment i still got the ability to speak i still got it i still got it thank you lord you've still given it to me so yeah um all right i gotta go get some stuff done i got a meal prep then go to church then teach the new believers class Yep, lots to do.